Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jarell, and today we're going to be doing a huge makeup haul um, from the drugstore. I got some stuff from Ulta, Target, Walgreens, and some stuff that I got from H&M that I'm going to be sharing with you. Um, so yeah, so I hope that you enjoyed this video, and if you do, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I will really appreciate it. Um, yeah, and that's it. So let's go on to the haul. So the first things that I actually want to start with is the stuff that I got at Target. So <clears throat> I order some of the stuff online and I also got some stuff at the store. This in particular, this is from the Sonia Kashuk uh, collection and it came in this case. Just to let you know, I had to do this video this is my second round doing this video so I opened everything up already on the first video but it came out all blurry so I had to refilm it just sharing that information with you but um this is the Sonia Kashuk and this is the packaging and is a face palette and this one looks like this so you have your blush contour powder and highlighter so just to let you know this is a limited edition palette so if you want to grab it i did find it online so you can get yours online uh the next thing that i got at target was an eyeshadow palette and this is like i said this is all drugstore products because i'm on the hunt of finding good stuff that i can incorporate in my future videos that not you know not everything being high-end but i'd want to find products that i'm going to be able to enjoy and use and this palette had a great 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 reviews and this is the nyx ultimate palette shadow palette they're beautiful warm neutral shades so i wanted to get something that i know that i'm going to be using it for sure so this is one of the shadows right here and then another one That one is crazy insane. And let me swatch this one right here. So I'm going to be playing with this and let you know how the other shades work. So I'm excited to try this um, palette for sure. I mean, just you can see in the quality of the shadows. It's a lot of pigmentation, which is great. Um, so I'm just hoping that they actually blend I'm hoping that they blend well as well so we'll see that one the next product that I got from Target was this product right here this is the NYX honey do me up so it's supposed to have like gold flex on it which it shows here a little gold flex I don't know if you can see that you know it's supposed to be really really good for your skin now this is supposed to be a dupe for the Farsali elixir um this is very liquidy this is very it feels like it's thick in consistency as you can see so we will try it and see how that works i'm excited about that because this one was 14.99 it's still a little pricey for what it is but this one is very expensive so if this is a good dupe I'm gonna like that one. So the next thing that I got from Target, this mascara right here, the L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black. Everybody talks great things about this mascara. I've never tried it myself, so I actually wanted to try it. So I did today, it's okay. Um, I don't. I can't give you uh, an answer yet of whether I'm, I like it or not, but um, we will see. So the next things that I got from Target were hair products. And I got this one right here, which is that Not Your Mother's uh, Dry Shampoo. So I tried it already. And I, I, I think I'm... <laughs> I think I'm going to pass it along to somebody else, um, maybe who can enjoy the, the scent of it a little bit better. Um, it worked really, really good on my hair. Um, it didn't leave a white cast or anything like that, so that was really, really good. However, the smell of it is just too... I don't know. I, I can't describe it. I feel like it might... I feel like it smells like popcorn. I, I can't. I can't deal with it. So... 
I think I'm just gonna pass it along to somebody else and see if they like the smell and how they feel about the, the scent of it. But this one, on the other hand, I love so much. This one is the Night Your Mother's Beach Babe. Uh, it creates soft wave with sea salt spray. So I'm very, very excited about this one because it smells like beach, like the beach. Um, so yes, I like it. Um, this is what I use on my hair today and I didn't wash it or anything. I just use it on dry hair. So you can use it on wet hair or dry hair. And that's what, that's what I did just to create some texture on my hair, but just ignore the flyaways. But yes, that's what I have in my hair today. Now going back to makeup, I got from Target. The last things that I got from Target were uh, some NYX lip liners. Uh, all these four right here are the slide on, glide on, stay on, and definitely a turn on waterproof extreme color lip liner. Yes, that is the name of it. It's crazy long. Okay, so this one is the color Sunset. The Sunset right here. This one is Disco Rage. Disco Rage. This one is Bed Rose. Bed Rose. And this one is in the color Nude Suede Shoes. It's this one right here. And the la last lip color that I got is this one that is a matte lip liner. And this one is in the color Sway. And this one doesn't glide on. It's a little bit drier, but that's the color. I mean, that color is so beautiful. Okay, so the next products that I got were from Maybelline, and I got them from uh, Walgreens. Uh, this one is the Master Blush. So this is how it looks like. Um, I also got the Master Contour. And I'm really excited about this palette, actually. The next things that I got from Walgreens were the Master Strobing Liquid, and I got in the number 300 and 200. This is 300. And this one is 200. So those are the two colors. The 200 is more peachy pink and the 300 is very golden. So, and then I got a this lip palette from L'Oreal. I thought it was pretty cool. So you can combine them and create your own different shade. The next two items that I got were from Ulta and I actually ordered them because I couldn't find them online. It was the Master Bronze. So I pretty much have everything in the master line of Maybelline. So these are the, the shades right here. Okay, the next product that I actually bought and ordered from Ulta was the Chrome. Now there were a lot of people saying that they could get theirs uh, in Amazon, but I, was, I saw it online for Ulta and I was able to order it. So this highlighter is very well talked about right now this is what it looks like let me swatch it yeah that highlighter looks good it's very yellow very gold okay so the next items that i got were the h&m uh products and i actually got them i was very excited they were very inexpensive especially the palettes that i'm about to show you they were only ten dollars per palette so this is the packaging that it comes in they all come in the same packaging uh, and I got three of the palettes. So this one is Smoky Nudes. So this is the packaging. Black. And this is the back. It's a very cool tone. This one is the Supernaturals. And I love, I love, love this one. I love the green right here. I think they're so amazing. So let me swatch. Let me swatch the screen right here. That's the green. 
me get the darker green. So there's some fallout. So that's the darker green. Let's try this one right here. Oh yeah, that's a really nice color. Okay, so the next palette that I got was the Ready Set Glow. And this one looks like this. Very neutral. So if these palettes are any good on the eyes, I will let you know uh, my opinion on them soon. Or maybe I actually do a tutorial just using the, the shadows to see how they blend. But for $10, if they work well, I mean, that will be really, really good. A good price for a full palette because it comes with, what, nine colors? So yes, that will be really good. Um, so the next thing that I got was a liquid lipstick and this one is in the color um, Should I Coco? So this is the color. So the formula is very thin. So that's the color right there. Very nice mauve, mauve color. Uh, and I got a lipstick. This is the packaging for the lipsticks. And this color is Sandstorm. So it looks like that. And this one is very, very creamy satin finish. Okay, you guys. So yeah, that's it for my haul. I hope that you enjoyed this haul. And I am very excited to be using all these products in a future tutorial. Um, if you want me to use anything in particular that you've seen of any of the stuff that I got, please let me know. Products that I'm most excited about really are these ones right here. This one, the Sonia Cache and definitely the highlighter from Maybelline um, as well as this purple <laughs> as well as this purple uh, lip liner I'm very excited to see how it actually shows up on my skin if you're interested in seeing how I am going to use these products please uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also uh, click on the little bell so you can get notifications whenever I upload a new video. Um, but yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe and thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye!